Welcome back to our little wayward slip through time on a blind Star Ocean Let's Play. And last time I had this lady here at the bottom tell me about one of those I explain the contents of each skill set to everyone. Oh, well, it was a skill set, apparently. I think I told, asked her about knowledge. How about sense this time? Sense level 1 consists of good eye, aesthetic sense, and patience. Okay, but what do those do? Enlightening. What's technique level 1 do? Technique level 1 consists of gale, kitchen knife, sketching, and whistling. What the hell is gale? Guildmaster. Hey, won't you buy some skill information? You can't learn any of these skills if you don't. So you better buy a you little bitch. Uh, yeah, I guess we should, probably should. Uh, decent amount of money. Yeah, I see no real reason to not buy these. I wonder if any of those were specials. Doesn't look like it. How am I gonna, how would I use hers anyways? I control Rat Boy. <clears throat> I control. <clears throat> yeah, my voice is a little messed up. I control Rat X the entire time. Whatever. Advisor, will you listen to what I have to say? Sure, why not? The goal of learning skills is divided into three main parts. Nash. Philosophy. One is gaining the bonus effects of the skills themselves. For instance, learning a knowledge might raise your intellect. So, unless you're Dorned. Do you know a guy named Dorned? And a paradox was born. How do you know about the future, old man? The second is acquiring specialty skill commands or abilities by learning specific combinations of skills like metallurgy and dash. And dash, as in the ability to run quickly? There are over 10 types, so if you think about learning them all, that'll be tough work. And the last one seems like the first one, but it's a little different. It's learning skills for use in battle. Learning combat skills is useful, but then you have a variation of battle capabilities. If you learn things like blink combo, it's not uncommon to become a battle junkie. That was quite long, but to put it concisely, it's important to think hard about skill points and use them in, for a set goal you have in mind. Cool! Yeah, I don't know how to use the skill system though, so... No pressure or anything. Oh, we couldn't take that job. Anyways, we could buy a bunch of skill books or something. Oh. Understand. That's actually a thing. Oh, okay. 
Huh. I mean, that was the first one I started with. I still got nothing for that either. Did she get all of those too? I'll assume yes. I'm sure those would come in handy eventually, right? Or Nixus, Millie. There are a lot of adventurers and mercenaries in this area, so... Fuck off. <laughs> it is not, not the most helpful of people in this town. But I guess we are barging into their random homes and whatnot. My grandson enjoys killing monsters. They went off to Silverland. Well, he was kind of a murderous little prick, so... His father was the same way. Fucking Vader. I told them they would... <clears throat> I told them if they would only be by my side, I'd be content. But they just can't give it up. This area is nice. If we were in Silverland area, there'd be a zillion monsters. We wouldn't even be able to walk outside! Oh, okay, so Silverland is apparently a wilderness or a frontier. People don't have the highest opinion of it. Monsters everywhere, they said. Port missed the castle town of War Kingdom. It's like a window for huge ships of each kingdom to come and go. Huzzah. But we apparently are missing our weapons. I still don't know why I gave up my sword. We have swords. What am I going to ditch one sword only to go? Anyways, there was a weapon shop earlier down here. Maybe if we equipped one of us with a weapon, we can take the job. How about this sword? It's the work of the finest swordsmith in the East. If you buy now, I'll make it cheap for you. This is a really good sword. Why not to buy it, Redix? Well, I will feel uneasy with that sword from now on. It's at half price for 24. buy it. Alright, I'll buy it. Come again. Out of the way. Hold on there. Now you're trying to palm off worthless crap to a bunch of idiots who don't know better. You again, you're bad for business. Damn. Beat the shit out of an old man. What is wrong with this guy? Eastern sword is more like this. Huh. Mm. Did he actually show me a sword or anything? Or is he just motioning like motioning to the sword on his back? Like, you know, more like that. Oh well, don't let the scummy weapon salesman fool you. Later. Cool. Sure, as a spirited salesman person. I mean, he did just beat the shit out of an old man for really not that big of a deal. I wasn't expecting like top notch work or anything. I just wanted a sword. Really, any sword would have sufficed as long as it was sharp and wouldn't break. from before.
Huh? I, I assume it's him talking. What, you already hired someone? Then it ain't my place to take the job. No, they were unreliable, so I... They just seemed so weak. Alright then, I'll spare them a spare sword. It'll be fine then, right? Hold on, hold on. You go with them! It'll be okay then. I just feel a little uneasy if it was just them. Alright, I guess. Uh, you guys want to go to Portmus too, right? Yeah, thanks. Likewise. I'm Size Warren. Nice to meet you. Likewise, Mr. Warren. I'm Radix Ferrance. No, no, the formality crap. I'm just Size. Okay. <laughs> and I am Iria Stravolti, but that's just Iria to you. Nice to meet you, sis. Well, uh, tomorrow afternoon I'll give you a pass, so come back then. There's some money to stay at the end. Stay the night at the end. Wow. Just throwing that into the, uh... Auto equips is accurate. I didn't even get a say in this. Oh shit, she got a free weapon too. Neat. An iron weapon to wear on your fists. Punching power is doubled. Nice. And what do you have? Two-handed sword. So who the hell is this guy? Barbarian rage. All right then. Every one of us is a potential bard right now. <laughs> and he's also a medium, so uh, we're, we're looking pretty good on the, either a heavy metal or possibly... Well, he's not really goth, but definitely heavy metal. He's headbanging with that hair. Does he get all of those things? Oh, cool. I guess they're just like, they're books, we have them. A source thought created while studying the Eldari two-handed style. Self-taught. Ah! What'd I do? Oh, I have 44 skill points. At least on Radix here. Considerably less in size now. Huh. Cool. I mean, he just, he seems like he should have hold down the B button to run. I wonder if anyone can, yeah. He seems like he should have that.
I guess he could be like a prospector. I don't know. I didn't think I'd be making them into whole people. Holy crap. The important thing is we have weapons. Uh, where's the end? I, wait, I know what this is. So, we have whole skill points. What are we going to have for each and every single person? And why doesn't Aria already know a bunch of shit already? Humans are spacefaring creatures at this point. Wow, 200 gold. 200 full for a night at the end was like 170 too much. And I think it's only casting us 10 for the three of us. Like, why? I'm not really complaining. That's all... That's extra money in my pocket, but... Yes, you have. You horrible, horrible person, you. Oh! Right, Dash. Oh, that comes in handy immediately. Sure! Because nothing will go wrong in Portmas. <laughs> I mean, I could pick up another one. Uh, I wish I could buy a pickaxe. We don't need any of that crap, though. We just need to get our ass to Portmas. It's not quite Mars, but we need to get there. I'm not really sure why. I kind of forgot. No, not X. It doesn't seem like Renixis and Mili have come through here. May we go in the Formus? This town sucks. There ain't even any booze here. <clears throat> Dang, I should have put dash on on uh I mean, whatever. Old rat boy here probably should learn dash too, just so everyone knows it. And besides. He's a warrior. He needs stamina, too. That's a... God, I could go over this for... If I could just go over this with a fine tooth comb, it would be insane. I should probably try and mix and match with their talents, though. Does make sense in originality. Hmm. Don't know if that is what I want in an original person. <laughs> I created this whole new recipe. What'd you use? Slime, maggot turds, and sulfurous ash. I'm not gonna lie, Radix, this is the best thing I've ever eaten in my life. I don't know how I, how I feel about that, but...
Right, right, right. You haven't seen any of my cohort. Ah, well, they're easy. There's you. What are you looking at? Huh? Oh, nothing. Except it's something shiny. Those are pretty earrings. You think so? I thought they'd look nice too. Ah. I wonder if they suit you. If they look good on anybody, it'd be you, Iria. Really? Thanks. Oh yeah, Rat Boy gonna get some human tail. This is like some reverse Captain Kirk Star Trek episode. Oh hey. Is something wrong with this wall painting? Doesn't it make you feel kind of strange? I wonder what sort of meaning was put into it when it was drawn. Yeah. I heard the son of the item shop owner here got inspiration from the arts of some of the ruins of the ancients in Druid. He's a wandering artist. I'm gonna be fiddling with his voice for a while. I get to I get the feeling to myself settle on something. Ancients? You never heard of them. Ah, tell us about them. Seems they don't exist anymore, but the word has it they were a real powerful race a long time ago. This sounds a lot like a captain. I didn't mean for that to happen. That was it? This is a tasteful picture, don't you think? Sounds boring. Let's get some action started here. Sure. I'll have to assume there's probably not much more to it than that. But what if I go into some of these other buildings? He's over here now. This town's boring, let's get something started, blah blah blah. At least see yes, I know exactly what kind of person you are. Honestly, people like him are usually more honest about who they are, they just don't care. Yes, it's it's a pretty picture. Kinda looks like a seahorse or something on the left and I don't know, actually, it kind of looks like some uh, random art that then it was hidden throughout the ruins areas in uh, StarCraft 2. All that talk of the ancients and whatnot. Anyways, we're getting a little past, uh, getting a little close to 30 minutes past 24 right now. And let's go. Let's go to Portmas in the north. It looks like that's the biggest town in this area. I hear it's bristling with people living away from their homes in more Castle Town. That's alright. Take care of that guy's request. And we will see us next time. Until then. Stay groovy, Space Cowboy.